And we had some fun in the Pleasure District, didn't we? But she was never just a regular geisha, was she? She took an extraordinary risk when she helped Fumi escape. She knew the likely consequences, but still she did the right thing. She may have looked like a flower, but she stung like a bee. If I'm going to do anything for Japan's future, I need to show the same commitment she did. Genzo is already working on a new plan. But I need some time to get things straight in my head. Why don't you pay a visit to Taka's grave? It's right here, in Saihoji Temple. Alright, welcome back everyone. We got another episode of Rise of the Ronin. The episode just kind of started on its own. Like, as soon as I walked up close to him, I wasn't expecting that at all. So, that's why it was abrupt like such. Let's, uh, let's pay her grave a visit. I tried to do some running around off camera, but I can only go to either here or here. Like, I can't go outside of this because I, I, I had these marked because I was going to go do these. Like, this is a photography jank. And I, this is a veil banner, but I can't even go outside to do any of those things. It won't let me travel or, or, uh, anywhere outside the either the Pleasure District or this castle place. I mean, this temple. Let's see what's over here. So, like, if I, if I, if I jump out here, it's, it's, it's going to try to teleport me back in here. It's, it's going to ask me, do I want to go to the Pleasure District or what the... I've never seen this dude. Oh, what's bro? Do I, do I want to go to the Pleasure District or do I want to go to the temple? That's the only two choices I get right now. I think once uh, things calm down, I'll be able to go to different places. <clears throat> Wait, but I mean, another, another person? So you heard. Oh, it's Eo. It's him. Let us pray for her. How the hell you even get here? Cast blame later. This is not the place. Who even let him in here? I am afraid I cannot stay long. I must fulfill my duty. Right, I'm gonna just do another intimidation. Indeed, I do, and that's not all. Under the Shogun, I will muster the power of the nobility and imperial court, strengthen our military, and negotiate a new treaty. A fairer one that shall protect our people and our wealth. Are you lonely? Dearest Taka, well, hold on. I won't be long. And when I join you, I shall give you the most exquisite hairpin you have ever seen. Bro killed her and then tried to come over here and apologize like he didn't do nothing. That's crazy. Give me a second, y'all. <clears throat> Let's see where they're trying to take me to next. I'm assuming we almost done. Uh, sitting there whining and stuff. It seems Gensui's latest plan is coming together. We're just waiting for everyone to get here. Ever since Gensui read Master Showin's last words, he's been all fired up about forging a new Japan. In fact, I'm pretty sure he's gearing up to attack the Red Demon's men head on. What do you think? Can you handle the fight? 
Wait a minute, let me let's change the topic for a second. Let me let me give him something. Sure thing. Yeah, I want to give him a gift first. We'll give him some chocolate. I need to go. I need to go back oh, somewhere so I, so I can so I can get more things. Oh. <laughs> I hope you have time, because it's as big as the ocean. But there are still uh, some moving parts. Up until now, I've always done what I thought was right. But what exactly that is changes with the spirit of the age. In the end, though, I know I'll make this country a brighter place. That's something I truly believe. It was a gift from Shinsaku. He bought it in Shanghai. Made by some American company, apparently. Obviously, I'm more comfortable with a sword, but it definitely comes in handy, in a pinch. I don't like how the Red Demon's gone about it, but opening up the country is a good thing. There's amazing stuff in the West. Good. Then let's do this, together. to that end. That's true. Hmm. <coughs> you always pop up at just the right moment, don't you? <sighs> Noma, look at this. Every last one of them is here to help us strike down the Red Demon. Hmm. Truly an impressive sight. Firstly, I would like to thank you all for joining us. We all come from different domains. Places with separate customs, different loyalties. In fact, some of our clans once opposed each other long ago. Yet we have cast aside our differences and come together. Truly a testament to Master Showing. We must strike in the name of all who have been oppressed. Let us not forget the pain of Master Shoin and the countless others who have suffered. We will bring this darkness to an end and deliver divine retribution to the Red Demon! allowed as many guards as the Shogunate provides. Do you expect the Chief Minister to flout the rules? Like we're about to do some things. Here they come. Retribution! 
All right, let's do this. Let's select the allies who we want. I like Gonzo because Gonzo just gives me uh, more money. Excuse me, he's almost at the next level. Ryoma's pretty high. He's, he should be leveling up after this. So we, I think we want to bring him to... Then we're going to go back like we did last time. We're not going to bring Ryoma. We're going to bring Gonzo and uh, oh other boy. I don't think they both get the strength and, th and stuff. And I'm not... I don't really need that. So I can't bring either one of these guys. Because they're all on the Sugar Knight side. But let's go ahead and bring Gonzo. Okay. <clears throat> I should hit up freaking... Uh, I should hit up freaking... Uh, Wow, I can't remember his name right now. That's crazy. Oh, Forte. Dang. Oh, I ain't got no stamina. I was, I was like, why am I swinging so slow? There's a, there's a couple people here. Defeat the protector and singers. Okay, so these these dudes must be like the. Yeah, cut that out, brother. Use my spear a little bit more so I can level it up. It's, it's, it's also stronger than my uh, oxtail. Come on now. Tough as hell for no reason. Come then. Come and take your prize. Oh my gosh. He, he, he's, he's doing like some real deal stuff. Oh boy. Up characters. First time I really started bouncing around on the characters for real. Oh, the blue ninja gotta be coming. Yeah, I knew he was coming to the blue demon. I mean, you here? I already dismissed you. Right. And so I came here of my own accord. As a man, I have the right to choose where I will die. Oh, right, you definitely gonna die here, my nigga. If they give me the option to kill both of y'all, you're done. Uh, I need to switch weapons because I can't use the slow weapon with this. Both of their health came back. Damn, nigga shot me out there. I was on the oh, I got no stamina. I was like, I was on the ground. I couldn't even do anything. I know. What the hell are y'all doing? I'm about to die. Yeah, I, I couldn't even do nothing about that. Like that, that death was. Oh wow. I don't know what it is about that that this this ninja dude, but he he just always whooping my ass, bro. Damn. 
Oh, I ain't got no stamina. No. Enemy Keyblades. In desperate situations, uh, some formidable foes who share a strong bond will be spurred to the thrill by battle and activating the Keyblades. Their combat stats will be significantly increased until one of them is either defeated. Oh, Jesus Christ. Not this nigga with his key getting bumped, boosted up. And, and then he just shot me from across the way. Bruh, I'm dead. I'm dead. And nothing, there's nothing I can do about it. That nigga had, had the utmost hits on me, bro. I can't do nothing. Even though Hondo's about to die here soon. I gotta break his posture. There we go. My strength appeal. Come here. Good. We got Hondo, we got Hondo dead, so... Oh, I tried to block that, but I couldn't. I, I ain't got no stamina. I, I can't do nothing. That's cheating. Get that shit out of here. I'm trying to heal. Oh, Gonzo's dead over there. Hold on, let me go get Gonzo. I hate when people, my, I hate when my partners do that. Because I'm not right there, my partners are like, oh, well, I shouldn't be here either. Let me go find you. Let me run away from the dude and put my back to him. Okay, somebody hit him. Somebody hit him. I said, dang, y'all about to let us get killed. Somebody could have hit him easily. Oh, I'm killing you for sure. I'm killing them. I, I, I understand what's going on. So if I spare him, I said I don't. I think I actually remember. I think I think I remember somebody sparing him, and he still wound up dying. So I'm gonna kill him myself. Cause I think some people wind up. I think I watched the Red Bread play this, and uh, he spared them, and I think he still winds up getting killed later. I'm definitely killing them, bro. Yeah, you killed old girl. Which I'm all, I'm all about, obviously, like, doing anything. I guess she did betray you and stuff like that. March and like I said... 18, the Red Demon was assassinated outside the Sakurada Gate of Edo Like I said, I'm, I'm, I'm for his values, just not the way he's doing things, I guess. I guess it really... I, I don't even know how to really put it. Like, I'm for opening up Japan. I just wasn't for him killing Taka. Or cutting my boy arm off and stuff like that. So, yeah, I mean, I had to get back at him. Wait, who are you? Time to die! wake of this incident, Shogunate authority plummeted as the rebellious samurai grew emboldened. Yeah, this might not be a good idea. The influence of the United States, which E had done so much to promote, waned, leaving the door open for the British to take their place.
After their triumph at the Sakurada Gate, Kusaka and his allies plot the next step in their quest to expel the foreigners. for your killer instincts. Let those beasts be. <laughs> so I think now I got a key blaze break. Oh, uh, what's this? Okay, now we finally beat chapter one. Oh, I did go back, like I said, and I did one of the little missions. <clears throat> I did one of the... Uh, like long gate mission things. I went back and I and it did keep my same level. And I killed the uh I killed old boy the blue demon on the uh I'm I'm I'm, I'm, I'm some of my words right now. I killed the blue demon on top of the words are not coming to me right now, y'all. I'm sorry. I killed the blue demon on the black ship and got the trophy. So most of your missable trophies, I, I feel like you can just go back and kind of get. Like, none of the trophies are completely missable, it seems like. See, now the area is opened up. Uh, I knew I knew something like this was going to happen. I knew something like this was going to happen. Given a, uh, a given local... Uh, damn, look how you may have alliances to either pro or anti shogunite forces. Deepen your bond with an enemy territory will allow you to liberate it in the future. Liberating locals... Um, will significantly strengthen your Ronin faction in uh, local bonds. Okay. I knew something like this was going to wind up happening. So these seem neutral, but this is pro Shogunite. Yeah, see, these neutral, neutral, neutral. But these, this is uh, anti Shogunite, I mean. Pro Shogunite, definitely pro Shogunite. It's in the middle, pro Shogunite, anti Shogunite in the middle. Anyways, next time we, we, I pop back on, I'm probably going to already have wandered through a bunch of these areas and unlocked a bunch of these things here because that's just what I do when I'm off camera. When I'm off camera, I, I uh, go around and I do all these little public things. See, now level 20 is getting up there. I do all these public order things. I do all the little side mission things before I come back on. And I do only the main quest with y'all. But I knock out all the side quest stuff on, on my own so I can get it knocked out. Let's see what new weapons we get from this. There's only one quest that's available. I think I might have missed that last quest. They said we can go back to the other area to get the Toby thing, but there's only one quest available now. Okay, we got some new uh, katanas. I don't really use the katana that much. I know uh, Forte said he uses the katana because the katana has so many different styles, and it does. It has so many different fighting styles that you can use for the katana that you can switch between. And he's like, that's why he uses it, but I, I don't use it just because like, I just don't. I don't really care to use it, to tell you the truth. Perfect sharpshooter. So I, I got some stuff to level up, but. All right. I'm not worried about my stats, the combat styles. I got, I, lo I unlocked some new, oops. I wish there was more styles for the fist and I would literally just go around fisty cuffing people, but there, there is no more styles for the fist. So I got fallen leaves. I'm locking a lot of like the circle so, uh, ones you have to unlock from getting the things advanced up. The same thing with, uh, well, not with X, with just circle. But I know I unlocked some new stuff with one of my, um, this, I think that ninja dude, that one ninja character I have. Yeah, that's his style. Oops, I keep doing that. I keep doing that. 
Let's go dual swords. We unlocked not a new style, but some new moves with it. We advanced it to rank. Said so novice. It goes novice, advanced, and then I think there's one more rank because I haven't gotten a trophy yet for getting it to the highest rank. That's how I know none of them at the highest rank yet because there's a trophy to get your techniques to the highest rank. Oh, I think novice, intermediate, advanced. Yeah, because you see the at novice you see the one diamond, advanced there's three diamonds, and uh, intermediate there's two diamonds. So yeah. I think that's one more step. It's probably master. It's probably the last step. I haven't used my Naganata in a minute, but I'm still leveling up stuff on it. I know I got something on this. A storm or Steel. See that uh, R1 and Circle technique I unlocked? I'm going to have to try that out and see what that is. And this is the one that's at freaking uh, advanced state now. <clears throat> but anyways, that was good. I now know how to use these. I didn't really know how to use the blade, uh, the which we call it, the uh, other things and stuff. I know how to use a bunch of stuff now. But that's gonna be it for today's video. We'll pop back on. We'll see what Rioma has to say next. Hopefully, let me, hold on. Let me see if I walk close to him. If you're gonna start the quest, all right, cool. Because like sometimes when you walk close to them, it automatically starts the quest, and I don't, I didn't want it to happen. So we'll pop back on and we'll tackle the next quest with Rioma and go from there. Y'all just seen us get some revenge for Taka. We all about that. For y'all folks on YouTube, if y'all want to give your boy a like and subscribe, you know what I mean? Run those uh, views up. I would greatly appreciate that. Hey, and I'll catch y'all in the next one.